Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton for ID People. I'm here at ID World Rio de Janeiro and I'm joined by Sturi Ud. Sturi, good to see you again. Thanks for stopping by to chat. Um, I know you've got a couple of... Uh, it was not easy to get here. No? A challenge? I, had, I took the most difficult road possible through Malaysia, Burma, Indonesia, Mexico, and then here. Okay, for, bu for business? <laughs> so it was not just stopping no, by? No, no, no. <laughs> well, absolutely. Well, it sounds like you were passing, but on some kind of world tour. Right. <laughs> Where, uh, traveling for business? That's, that's yeah. right, yeah. Okay, and some uh, interesting markets there in Asia. What's, what's going on out there? Yeah, in this field, particularly in the ID field, the whole world is in a great change, mm. mood, uh, sometimes it's just mood, yeah. sometimes it's real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So much depending on the politicians, so much depending on companies controlling a market. Yeah. But the changing mood is everywhere. Yeah. Uh, the potential and the need for change is everywhere. Yeah. It's as big in Europe as it is in Africa. Yeah. And here, for example, obviously, um, <coughs> trends being some trends being driven by large infrastructure investment as a result of the World Cup and the Olympics. What kind of challenges are you seeing out here in South America for you? Ah, I think you don't like me to reveal any state secrets. No, no, no. <laughs> I think that would be bad. <laughs> uh, Latin America is, from one side, quite advanced in ICT. Mm. Uh, in many issues, even before Europe, if you look on the banking sector, payment mm -hmm. sector, it's quite advanced, actually. But when we talk then about the ID, let's say the general ID, still, of course, Latin America is in the, let's say, control phase of issues. Right. And if you look on, on the whole picture, mm. uh, Information, if you look on information, you can use information in the best case of the world yeah. as knowledge, as intelligence. Mm. It's how human yeah. came to yeah. be that master of the, un of the nature. Yeah. But, and it's based on, on information, but it's used as knowledge, as, as intelligence. Yeah. The, smallest and the most stupid part of this information is control. Just for control. Choose information just for control. It never develops anything. Okay. It, it just keep as is or in worst cases prohibit some new things to start evolving. Yeah. And, and we have a degrees of using information in between the, the control last stupid small yeah. issue of information up to the knowledge. In between you have security issues, you have power issues and so on. A lot of degrees. And, and when we look on, 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 the, on the big scheme and big scale, uh, yes, the next leap for any civilization, civilization is to use information as knowledge. Yeah, and it's, it's, um, <coughs> it's all there, isn't it, in terms of data and it's really what you do with it. It only becomes intelligent if it's used wisely. Good. That is from one side easy to, to, to explain. You should just skip the focusing on control mm. or let's say mastering, yeah. forcing yeah. some information. I give you a good example. I might give it later also in the conference, doesn't matter. Uh, but take healthcare. Healthcare consumes around about 20% of GDP. In some countries more, in some countries less. And it's just increasing. It's even bigger issue than oil for the development of the world. Yeah. Now, just to have one quite good example. In Europe, in the US, also now in the more developed parts of, of the developing world, mm -hmm. if you look on a doctor who's taking care of a patient, half of his time, He's taking care of the patient. Half of his time, he's typing in information to different systems. Mm. So what has happened? Some ICT people in this field of control has been thinking that this is important. And of course, from one side, it might be. But as a total picture, it ends up in you educate a doctor. It's a heavily cost. 
he pays only half of his time to the real issue of taking care of uh, sick people. The biggest part is doing something else which has nothing to do with his knowledge, yeah. which was cost a lot of costs to create. The whole room full of equipment doing nothing while he's typing in. Yeah. And this has to do with the ID. You don't have a proper automatic ID function of people, documents and products. Yeah. And so you don't have. Yeah. It's still in the middle age yeah. logic. And furthermore, even more let's say catastrophic. This knowledge of a healthcare guy or educated doctor shouldn't even 50% be used to take care of sick. It should be to take care of those who still are healthy but might be sick. Yeah. Because 70% yeah. of the illnesses are living yeah. 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 by Lifestyle. your life. Yeah. So all this starting from control mechanisms which are now the 99% of all the issues in a hospital is making a catastrophical impact on the health healthcare system. Yeah, yeah. So but maybe that as an example. That's a good example, but the data is there that we need, and it's as you okay. say, we it's need using the data. that data and processing that data and using it intelligently to exactly to create the results. And we need even more data than we have today. We need, let's say, big data. Uh, you should. You, you, you might be afraid of it, but if you want intelligence, you need even much more data than mm. we have today. And it should be an automatic process. As I told you, this typing is a catastrophe yeah. for, 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 for the development of a country. Yeah. And I can give you, education is the same and so yeah, on. Yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. what we yeah. tell those people. So what we, we then, in, I'm not speaking just of philosophical reasons. <laughs> No. <laughs> we are actually doing this. We, 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 we are strongly promoting cardless solutions and doing systems where you can collect the data automatically. Right. We call it auto ID. It consists of people ID, it consists of documents ID, it consists of work performance ID, mm -hmm. not just a product ID, but also the process, process ID. And you really can with mobile phones today and, and using online services, you, you can do that. Yeah, and to connect everything together. Yeah. It's, the, it's the internet of things, as people like to call it. Operating that is one in. step of the story as yeah. well. Yeah, yeah, right. You can, and the internet is good to handle information, but the core is to gather information even much more than today. Mm. But then after that comes the very big step to understand what to do with that yeah. information. And there, that's why we need this step in thinking, because if you don't think on other way than today, mm. you end up in a lot of data and just use it for control. Yeah. And then we are in the shit again. Yeah. <laughs> so, so, so what you need is a methodological new way of approaching things. I think it will come, we like it or not, but yeah. to use big data, but with a clever understanding, what for? Yeah. So the doctor, is focused in the future on gathering and having such data of people so they can really take care that that person, that guy, don't enter into sickness. Yeah. So Prevent it before yeah. it's there. Yeah, so effortlessly gathered data and intelligently processed will generate the result we want. But that's a complex, you know, that's a, almost a mind shift and a complex change to get people away from the data for control, data for um, management and measurement, but data to actually provide the control data. idea and methods is Led now pushing civilizations into a non development mm. performance. Yeah. Yeah. So, ID world is much bigger than the yeah. name, yeah, it stays yeah. for <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's de facto the basic for any knowledge based society, yeah, if to change over. Yeah, and avoiding being slaves to the data, that data yeah. slavery that Definitely. we have trained people. Good example I bring you from, from Algeria. Uh, I was discussing with, with the authorities uh, to modify the uh, car register system. And they told me they have bought a wonderful system. And they really bought just now a new system and they were happy with it, with printing out a new mm. kind of register. and. Then they were thinking how to be making the police force able to, to, to control it in the street, that it was authentic, that it was not fake, because all papers you can fake in one way or another. Doesn't matter what is there. Yeah. Uh, and professionals can do it. 
uh, anyhow. So I told, told them, are you really interested in what? Are you interested for the police force to do something? Or are you interested to avoid fake of cars? I mean, stealing cars, which was the main item to find out if the car is stolen. Are you touching the idea, the concept, or just something for the police force to do? Yeah. He said, no, 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 touching the, the, the stealing of the cars. Okay, I said, hey, there is much more interesting way to do it, and you can really do it. You should allow the consumer to check the car register in a way so he can know if it's stolen or not. He will not buy it, at least not for the price. Yeah. So when the price goes down, you take away the economical interest and then you don't have it. You don't need that police guy who might find one out of them. Yeah, which is a much and, more and, and open that, approach, isn't it, to data? That's the intelligent way of using information. Yeah. So mobilizing and consumer-oriented solutions, they are there. Yeah. The mind is the problem. Yeah. The mind of technologic experts, yeah. which are still focused on a technological solution, not a methodological change yeah. of, of, yeah. of functions. Yeah. yeah, and the process, what we're using it for, what we're trying to win from it, what the gains are going to be. And you're going to be talking about that in the CEO vision, I guess. Um, I, tomorrow. I'm almost sure. Yeah, and hopefully it will spark, <laughs> it will spark some debate. Yeah. It, it, it's a great opportunity for, 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 let's say, people who would like to make an impact on, 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 on the development of, of civilization. Mm. So it's a huge possibility for politicians and, and, and also technological people to really bring something new on the table. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, of course, we have a tradition to do it other way around. You don't put anything on the table, you just play with existing issues in a clever way. Mm. But that doesn't bring something. Yeah. But on the other hand, now is the time like, let's say, Google time yeah. in this ID industry to bring the new concepts on the table. Yeah. And they will run by their own force, like yeah. water. They will it will be fine. Yeah. Well, Story, thank you for chatting to me. I'm sure you amongst many will be the people to challenge the norms and shake it all up a little bit. So thanks for stopping by. And Only uh, for good, yeah, not for bad. Of course. <laughs> and I uh, hope you have a good, a good couple of days here at ID World. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thanks Lovely. a lot.